morning. <laughs> How are we? Are we fine? Tenerife. Oh yes, Pete and Shell's back on the island again. Just stepped outside of the hotel. Beautiful. Lovely and warm. It's been a bit cloudy since we arrived. But today, as you can see, it's getting a bit thinner. The clouds are getting a bit thinner. See the bit of the blueness coming through. What time is it? 25 past 11. Well, 23 minutes past 11, if you want to be exact. I don't normally like that. Oh no, yeah. What day is it? Yeah. <laughs> Wednesday. One of the days of the week, anyway. So we're going to go on a wander. We are eventually going to get some breakfast somewhere. Fancy an omelette. So we're going to take you from where we are. Down over. Los Cristianos. That's where we are. We're going to... Take it for a bit of a street walk. So the Andreas Hotel is where we are staying. You know, various other hotels around you, apartments and things like that. So there's no actual plan of which streets we're going to do, we're just going to Complete random Los Cristianos wonder. So, literally, what, 20 yards up there on the left, hideaway bar, which is a nice place to sit and have some food and drinks and hide away if you don't want to be seen. So, you've got a Chinese place here. I'll just quickly scan the menu. There's sushi, you like sushi, don't you? I like sushi. On the light though. Yeah, things with sushi, it's got to be really fresh. Yeah, from last there's night. There's the, oh, that's the opening times there. There's some prices there. The butcher shop there. I mean, places to eat and drink, you're not short of anywhere in the area really. Plenty of plenty, uh, plenty of choices, plenty going on. Depending on what food you like. Mm, I like well, I like Christianos because it's. I don't know. It's just it's got that. It's lively. There's plenty going on, but it's also quiet. It's chill. It's. It's nice and it's a nice traditional feel to it. That direction there, if you go up there, bare left, you'll take you to where the church squares. And that's a nice place to go to on an evening. A nice atmosphere about it. So we'll wander down here. Yeah, we're going to do, the plan is, well, the plan is, we've got no plan, but the plan is when we do these street walks, we'll do various different mixed ones, different random ones. I mean, has much changed since we were here last year? No. There's one or two changes, isn't there? I would say. No, a lot though, isn't there? Like, we've got Churchill. That's a kind of little bar, Churchill's. We're in the uh, first night we got here. Got all your usual souvenir shops around. ATMs. Star of Bengal Indian, which is comes up quite a lot as a recommended place to try. If you like your Indian food. I'm 
In fact, I even now study it and smell the spices. Mm -hmm. The next to Star of Bengal, you got a charity shop, which we quickly called in yesterday. <laughs> you want to spend more time there, didn't you? Yeah, no, up to you. <laughs> Thank you, Captain. Yeah. My Italians. What's up there? State agent? And the lovely horse that will play a park area there for the kids. Nice palm trees. I love palm trees, mate. My favourite tree. All the trees are available. Destino. A few pictures of food there and a few prices. Depending on what you like. Six ninety five for half a roast chicken. Chips and salad or vegetables and salad or whatever. There's Shell. I'm gonna sit down. So that's the street we've walked down. There's more over there but we'll Probably do that on, on a separate video. So we'll wander around here. Oh. Mm. There's the beach area down there with a the harbour. Where all the ferries come in with the uh, digging people in, taking people out to the islands. Some nice menus dot around here, good prices. We were in there yesterday having a breakfast, €2.50. Did a video on it, check it out. Plenty of shops if you want any clothes or souvenirs, etc, etc. Good choice about them, you're, not, you're definitely not short of... it's. It's a good selection as well, isn't it? A few people on the beach. Hippodino supermarket. You got some uh, exercise apparatus over there. Is that the right word? Apparatus? Yeah. That's a word you don't hear much of, you know? Apparatus, eh? I that if you fancy a bit of a workout, a bit of warm weather training, they're all free as well, just use them. A Viking boat there. See the sky, it's uh, still a little bit cloudy and a bit grey, but it is starting to thin out. Which means that gives a chance of the sun to pop out and warm the place up a bit. The corner. Crepes, milkshakes, smoothies. This is along here that do excursions and car rental, scooter rental, whatever rental you're looking for. P 
Pizzeria Steakhouse. Nice street up that way. It's just a maze of streets around here, isn't it? Yeah. I'll take you up that way in a bit. So in terms of location where we are now, like say if you if you're familiar with it, we're we're near there. This bit square here, you've got Burger King on the corner. Plenty of seats all the way along if you want to have a five minute sit down. People on the beach. <laughs> people, that's a skill. That's a skill. Watching people, people watching is a skill. There's a lucky lucky man selling glasses. <laughs> You've got places here that do the three course around the 10, 11 euro mark. Choice of starters. Choice of mains and desserts. Indian restaurants, Spice Empire. Which street are going up, Shell? Next? Um, I'm a bit more than that. If you continue along that way, brings you underneath that uh, tunnel. Then you go through the tunnel and you've got the chill out on your right hand side. Again, we'll do that in another video. We're just going to concentrate mainly on this general area. One rubber here and loop, loop back round. Mm. This is where we met Cole the other day. Cole's place. There's some beer prices there. Met him, yeah, we just sat here when they had the. We haven't got them out in a minute, but when they had the table and chairs out. Cole from Cole's place. This oh. little, excuse me, that's a little bar there. We're in. Oh, Steiner beer. Pizza Social Club. Is that where that guy's got a pizza from? Is it nice? Yeah. yeah. Oh, no. Right, which way? There's pension player accommodation. You want to do a walk down here? Mmm, just getting a smell. Mmm, mm. different seafood. Leather goods. Italian pizzeria. Tapas. That's the street there that we've come along. Super Mercedano. Mercado. Dyla Pre Centre. Pension Palamo. Well, they all have different names, don't they? they the first name's the pension, that's the uh, accommodation group, I think. They've all got different names. Selection of tapas. Tapas. Seafood. Roast leg of lamb. Lasagnas. Bowl of mussels. All sorts of good food. Ten tapas, ten tapas for two people, 25 euro 95. Mm. There's literally restaurants just hidden in, hidden in different corners, isn't it? It's one of these areas where 
when you come down at night time it's totally different, it looks totally different. And you see places that doesn't sort of highlight itself during the day. Tattoo place up there, barbers, Pearsons. We've got a jewellers there on the corner. Another jewellers. This is nice, this is one of my favourite streets around here actually, this one. All these different shops. Some shops are kind of like a bit more high end than others and some places are cheap places where you get some bargains. If you forgot any clothing or forgot any items that you didn't bring or you find out that you need when you get here. <coughs> Here's what I mean about the high end side of it. You've got like obviously a shop down there which is doing clothes, more the budget side and then you've got shops like that. A mm, bit more boutique -y type, a bit more money, probably better quality, but depends what you want. Show, oh, here we go. Here we go, Shell's going shopping. So Shell went in the shop and she didn't buy nothing. Isn't that right? She nearly yeah. did, you almost did. You almost did. I might yet. She might yet. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Hey? Oh, a sweet shop. Sweet shop. You know, it's too early for sweets. Yeah, little, little tapas bar. I say there's loads of little places in just tucked away in little corners that if you blink, you miss them. ATMs dotted around on the different streets. This is a church square. I mean, this on this on a night time when it's all lit up and it's it's got like that kind of night time vibe about it. I hear a helicopter. There it is there. Yeah, it's just a maze, maze of streets around there, isn't it? So if you go along that street there, that takes you back along towards where the hideaway boy is. Coffee in the corner. Hey. Yeah, there is. Yeah, um, well, this street really walk along this this one. This kebab shop that's open till early hours of the morning. So this is where we started. Andreas Hotel just up there and we walked down this way before like I say it was just a little quick street walk really I mean we've probably missed definitely missed off a couple of streets up there but we'll include them on another video mm. so we're gonna go for breakfast quick street walk before we go for I think I'm gonna go for an omelette I'm gonna mm. move for an omelette I think an omelette of coffee and a fruit juice get the day started and then we'll uh, see what happens after that. Mm -hmm.
So don't worry if we've missed a few streets off. We do intend to do some more street walks. Dear time definitely, and depending on what's happening in the evening, we will do a few nighttime walks as well. The streets look totally different on the night time. You see bars and restaurants that you don't notice through the day. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do with that like button. And uh, subscribe, it's all free. Share the videos, that'll be nice. And if you have any questions in relation to the videos, type away. We'll get back to you as soon as we can. And that's it. I fancy an omelet. Ham, cheese, tomatoes, peppers. And shall, I, sh and shall I have the same, but with mushrooms, because I don't do mushrooms. Let's go. Let's go. Take care of yourselves and we'll see you soon somewhere in Tenerife. Bye.